Carla. I think music is universal, like it's a universal language. Even if you don't sort of understand what is being said, but you still feel. <laughs> Africa, the music is everywhere. Like we start singing at school, at church. Everywhere you go, you'll be filled with the melodies of Africa. Music is, is our thing in Africa. For us, music is just like breathing. You know, it's an everyday thing. I have songs to sing when I'm depressed. I have songs to sing when I'm happy. I have songs to sing when you're in love. If I'm not listening to music on the headphones, there's a song playing in my mind. And it's like, I couldn't imagine my headspace without music. I think music is probably, out of all of the arts, is the most powerful. It is definitely the tool for proper expression. It's like the engine. If I could be left with one thing that is earthly and everything else taken away, I think that's the only thing I would hold on to. Even if I couldn't be able to sing it, just to hear it. It's bigger than us. It makes me, I don't know, brings joy to my heart. It's all about the beauty in it, you know? There's a lot of people from different countries in your class and in your school. Costa is from Russia, I think. There's this fella in our class, his name is Costa. <laughs> Costa. <laughs> He's from Russia. <laughs> Marietta is from Nigeria. Bethlehem. <laughs> Which is not. From Croatia. Croatia. Over in Croatia, do you know animal bars? They're like 20 cents and over there, let's say, it'd be about 50 or 40. I like Ireland more. My friend Catalina is from Lithuania. <laughs> oh, she's not. Catalina from Moldova. My name is Catalina and I am from Moldova. And um, in our country, there's no Halloween. What country does Prince come from? South Africa. What is that? And Adams is from, where are you from? I don't know. Eat, let me see. Adams is from Nigeria. You know the PlayStation are black and grey in Ireland, but in Nigeria they're red and red and white. Okay, can we talk now? Okay. And pink. Okay, pink. Go ahead, bus. Adrian is from Poland. Santa comes in Poland too, twice. Monica is um, from Lithuania. Um, a girl called Monica in my class. She's from Lithuania. My name is Monica and I am from Lithuania. When you're communicating with people and interacting with people from different cultures, you're exposed to other types of attitudes. My mom's mom. I miss her. Your granny. No. It is. It my is. mom's granny. And my granny. No, listen. She really says my mom's mom. That's your granny. No. My mom's. My mom's mom's mom's. My mom's mom. Yeah, and that your granny. I would be much happier. 
if my child met a child from a different country and was able to communicate with them on a nice level, then to come home to me and tell me that they got an A in maths. I would much prefer my children to be socialised than educationalised. I was six years old when I killed the art. I was six too. They speak English in my country. I had no idea, but I knew some stuff. Just bye. Just bye. Hi. 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 I love you. Bye. Here. Oh, you love him. <laughs> <laughs> she just said that. But the only hard thing was the Irish. But now the people say I'm good at Irish and my mum says, oh, are you Irish girl now? <laughs> I think culture is melting. All across the board, culture is becoming one thing. There is things that are dynamically different, but if you're looking at it from a bigger spectrum, if you want to analyze it into small bits, then you'll find millions of differences. But if you look at it from a broader spectrum, you just see how cultures are becoming the same. People are hungry to hear, you know, truths about spiritual methods, religious methods, political methods, you know. There's always wisdom in music. What music do you like? Lithuanian, English, and Lithuania, English, Irish, Russia, Russia, Russia. Yeah. hip hop, rock, eh, la 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 la, dance music. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite type of music is Eminem, Shakira, or jazz, or. I like Britney Spears songs. Oh sure. Jennifer Lopez songs. Pop it louder. <laughs> Pop it louder. Madonna. America. Where's your name from? Where's your name from? America. America. <laughs> He's not from America. He is. Is he? Dolly Parton. And what I like about Usher, he's uh, he's kind of same tan as me. He's kind of the same as me. Mine is um, Britney Spears. Or uh, sometimes um, 50 Cent. That's my mum's as well. Smokey. And um, Shakira. That's bad music. Put your hands up, bend your knees, bounce around a second, like get down me. Oh, come on, come on, it's not hard to let. Come on, come on, it's color you turn. That's what he sings. It's cool. He raised me up. I like the floor, I smack that. Give me some more, I smack that. Till you get so I smack that. Oh, smack that. It's like this. Pop, push your bum, push your bum. <laughs> Can you sing Shakira? No. <laughs> saddest things is to watch these people from different nationalities who have different ways of socializing and a lot of these people that have come from different countries still have that very very strong sense of community and there's nothing there for them when they come here and for me one of the saddest things I think I saw was a, a gig where in Kula Lego were playing and it's kind of the bullishness of the Irish drinking culture being kind of pushed on them. And I'd be afraid for African children and for European children that that's going to be how it is for them. Why is music intrinsically being promoted along with alcohol? Why can't we bring it away from that and show people that they can actually do these things 
in the middle of the day with a cup of tea and a ham sandwich. I mean, there's no reason why it can't be. I think that this band is the start of promoting a different type of culture in, in Ireland. It's part of my culture, where I'm from. It's music, this music that everybody sings from a three-year-old child that's playing in the street. All the games that they play have a little song that goes with it to an old woman in church. It's an everyday thing. Kids born in Ireland are obviously not too familiar with their own culture. Because the problem is the kids grow up here in Ireland and they speak English and they turn totally Irish. And when they go home, I mean, they're just aliens. They might be coming from China, Japan, Africa, India, you know, so the aim is to get the children as well, you know, to learn more about their culture because they are here now, you know. We need to have this community school where all of them come, you know, regardless, you know, and uh, easy access to music education. We need to do that if in, we want to see the bright future for the kids. Uh, it means freedom, you know. Music is, it can create freedom because music makes people come together. So that's the kind of a thing we must create, uh, make people come together to experience the freedom of life, like, you know. We are going to hear now a solo. Weltweite Kommunikation, ein bildhafter Ausdruck, vermittelt durch das Medium von Klängen. <lacht> <lacht> 